15 minutes and you're out of here. Isn't that exciting? Woo! Uh, but uh, in a half hour or so, right? Uh, Kate and I have been in charge to, to do this mechanism, so things that drive growth, not only referral growth, but also membership growth in the last next 15 minutes. We're hoping to do that, but again, you guys have been sitting for a while. We want to have a little fun while we're here, too. Okay, so Kate and I have come up with how many of you have seen the show Mythbusters? One of my favorite shows, matter of fact, just the other day I sat through a marathon like six hours of Mythbusters, and I just love Mythbusters. My son and I, we, just, we kind of figure things out as, as they're going through these uh, different scenarios. So today, we're going to have a little fun. Kate and I come up with a little B and I Mythbusters of our own. And here's what we're going to try to do as far as the, the myth that we're going to try to bust today. And Michelle's going to come up and she can help us with our board as far as our confirmation board as, as they do as far as in Mythbusters. But here's the myth we're going to try to solve today. Number one, can Kate shoot an apple off of my head. We're going to see that today. And as you can see, I've got a good head to shoot one off of. But Kate, if you go back to your position. Now, Kate uh, and I discussed as far as using a real gun. But we thought with all the glass in this room, it probably wouldn't have been a good idea. So we thought maybe a bow and arrow? But again, that could deflect and many people might get hurt with that. So we have come up with the Exterminator 3000, which was Kate's Weapon of choice, as you can see back here. Um, and so Kate is going to use the Exterminator 3000 to, to shoot this apple off my head. And again, being that we also uh, believe in preserving fruit, um, I've come up with my own apple for today as far as the target uh, that we're going to shoot off of my head today. Um, so this is what Kate's going to be using. But as in traditional Mythbusters fashion, I want to warn all of you, do not do this at home. We are trained professionals that are working on this for a long time. So please, do not do this at home. Okay? Can you do the no part of your face. Yeah, um, so if you don't mind, Kate, if you want to take your, your spot right there, I'm going, to, I'm going to go ahead and put my little target on. Now, before we start here, again, the myths that we're going to, we're going to sh work on today are, number one, can Kate shoot an apple off my head? But we're not going to make it easy for Kate, because the first one she's going to do is, while blindfolded, can Kate simply hit this target? blindfolded by simply listening to my voice. Now again, please do not do this at home. We, right, we are trained professionals. Now Kate, are, do you have that on securely? I've got it on, I can't see a thing. Okay, okay, okay. perfect. Now can you hear my voice clearly? Yes, I can. Okay, so you feel pretty good about where we're at now. I think I feel really good, Keith. Okay, now hold on a second. Before we start this, I've got to check the, uh, you know, we've got some wind current going on here too. So I'm going to make sure that we're Aiming just right with the wind and all that kind of stuff, Kate. Okay, okay. Kate, I think I'm ready. Are you ready? I'm for ready, Chief. First section. Okay. I'm okay. ready. The first myth: Can Kate hit this apple off my head blindfolded? Kate, go ahead. Can <laughs> I get you? Oh, it's fine. Kate's fine. Yeah, I'll work. What's happening, Kate? <laughs> Technical difficulties. Technical difficulties. Hold on. Bear, bear with us. Okay, hold on, okay, listen to my voice. Okay, okay. Did it go? <laughs> Back on my head. All right, Kate. 